The average UK citizen will brush their teeth over 40,000 times in a lifetime using a staggering 80 litres of toothpaste. And it's such a routine part of our everyday lives that the only time we think about it is when it runs out. Now that's a shame, because toothpaste is fascinating stuff. Tooth care remedies have been around for thousands of years. The world's oldest surviving formula is Egyptian, and it was made from mint, flowers, salt and pepper. It dates to the 5th century AD, and by all accounts it worked very well, although it did have the nasty side effect of making your gums bleed. Having said that, it was far less hazardous than some 20th century brands. In the Second World War, German scientists from the nuclear industry developed radioactive toothpaste with thorium for their domestic home market. It cleans, it kills germs, it's radioactive. Fantastic. Now, why didn't that catch on? So thorium wasn't a great idea, but other additives were much more successful. In 1901, a dentist in Colorado Springs noticed that locals had far fewer cavities than was the norm. The reason was eventually tracked down to high natural levels of fluoride in the water. From this basic observation, fluoride quickly became the dental wonder additive of choice. So what goes into modern toothpaste and how does it work? Well, the number one ingredient is something abrasive, you know, something to scrub your pearly whites. For this, toothpaste manufacturers typically use baking soda or chalk or even silica, which is a refined type of sand. Then many add whitener, flavouring, something to make it foam, something to bind it all together, and finally fluoride. Now, did you know you can make your own toothpaste out of simple household ingredients? For this recipe, all you need to do is mix three tablespoons of baking soda with one tablespoon of salt. Then add three teaspoons of glycerine. Mix them all together with a dash of water. And finally, add one teaspoon of peppermint and hey presto, do it yourself toothpaste. For a proper test of its effectiveness, I'm going to stain my teeth with licorice. I have some very sugary pop. That'll fur them up, that'll do a treat. Now, my teeth feel awful, so let's put this homemade toothpaste to the test. Actually, that does seriously feel good. That is much better. It tastes quite minty, very abrasive. It's incredibly salty, but it's cleaning my teeth. Feel so much better. And hopefully my teeth look a bit cleaner. Mmm, homemade toothpaste. It works. <laughs>